Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I hope you are doing well. I hope you can hear me well. Um, I realized in the last video, there was a bit of an echo. So hopefully it doesn't happen again this video. If it does, I apologize. But anyways, thank you for joining me in this video and I hope you are doing well. Before getting started, of course, like and subscribe, support the channel, yada, yada, yada. Um, so, today I wanted to try something new. I got this inspiration from this movie. I think it's on Netflix. I believe it's on Netflix. It's called The Perfumer, and it's a book series that they turn into a movie. It's a strange movie, but long story short, this guy has this superpower where he can smell. He has a very, very strong sense of smell. And throughout the movie, he's trying to find this perfect scent. And I don't know, I just got inspiration from that where I was like, you know, maybe I should create some um, oil perfumes. I've been wanting to do it, but I feel like that movie kind of like, cheesy to say, I feel like it motivated me to create this video. So, I um I bought the essential oil packet which comes with 30 aromas so a lot of options and I ended up cleaning some of my roll-on perfume containers that I had already so I got that case from Amazon which I will link below and I'm using almond oil for this it was recommended to be good um, when it comes to oil perfumes. So today we are going to do four. Um, what I like about this case in particular is that it has a booklet which comes with like description of each, each scent and the benefits of that scent. So like, um, Pretty much it explains like either either have a mood enhancer or helps with depression or something of that sort that um, that when you combine certain scents together you, you can create that effect. So I thought that was interesting and I wanted to try it out myself. <laughs> and um, yeah, so with that being said, um, I should have had this already but I didn't. Um, anyways, <laughs> so what I was thinking is putting like half, maybe a little less than half of almond oil and then the rest essential oil. Um, I don't really know the ratio. So I'm just going to pour some in there and see what amount looks good. Um, this is not a DIY <laughs> at all. This is just me trying on new things, trying to be creative. So, is that a lot? Is that a lot? I feel like that's a lot. Um, oh well, <laughs> can't go back now. So we're gonna, I guess we're doing that ratio for all of them, because I want them to all be even. And if anything, next time I'll know to put less. So. Okay. But I hope you guys are doing well. I, I hope you guys saw that full moon yesterday. The Gemini moon, girl, it was big and bold, okay? It was definitely giving what it needed to give <laughs> and I absolutely loved it. It was gorgeous. So, okay, I put them in the bottle and we are going to, let me open this booklet and see which ones I want to use. So let me see if I can, okay, so I'm using another camera for the setup, if you can see. But if you look in the booklet, it has, um, I wanted to make sure it was in focus. It has like, it legit says, for psychology, cheers up emotions, eliminate fatigue, strengthen nerves, and 
helps with concentration. And then for psychological, it promotes um, blood circulation and relax the body and all this stuff. So I was like, okay, <laughs> um, why not? So what I was thinking was, you know, honestly, I must just wing it because I didn't really have a certain way I wanted to do this, but Maybe what I could do is have one for like calming the nerves, another one for like mood enhancer, all that stuff. So we are going to do that. We're going to start on the first page. So we're going to do, I'm going to put them in order so then you, um, you guys can see the whole process. Okay, so I'm gonna do peppermint. For, and what I was thinking too, I'm like, I think maybe like three for each bottle will be good enough because I don't want it to be too much where you can't even smell like what's in there. It just smells like one. <laughs> so I'm gonna be a bit cautious with how much I put. And what I also like about this case, it comes with um, the tear droppers, so you can just, you know, somewhat be organized. So it comes with two of them. Um, so we're gonna do peppermint, and we're gonna do lavender. I love lavender, so we're gonna do lavender. Lavender is my favorite, favorite smell, flower, everything. So we have lavender, peppermint, and I want to use maybe the mm, eucalyptus, maybe. Let's do eucalyptus, wherever you are. Is it this it's right in front of my face y'all anyways <laughs> so okay got three for the first one and then so that would be like for calming the nerves and then let's see let's see let's go back on the first page so for the second one we are going to do grapefruit where's grapefruit okay grapefruit grapefruit does motivates emotions to boost the spirit and relieve stress so i'm gonna put that there and then we're gonna use rosemary which makes your mind clear and focus your attention is this rosemary yeah and then the next one we're going to use lemon which rejuvenates and refresh your mind I'm trying to like find stuff that complements each other, but then also like sounds good together. <laughs> so we got three. Now we have, let's see, let's see, let's see. We have two more. Let's do lemongrass. Girl, at this point, I'm, this third one, I'm just gonna pick a scent that I want together. So we're going to do lemongrass and we're going to do, what is this one? Oh, we got sage. We're going to do sage, lemongrass, sage, and okay, I can't find jasmine. I know I didn't take that one out yet. Yeah, okay, I have it. Got it, y'all. I got it. Okay, now we're on our last one. So... This one, I want to use like weird names. I don't know, Yang. We got a Yang one. And we got, I kind of want to use Rose. I don't know, this one. Gymnemium. Gen it's a flower. And then we're going to use, I guess we're going to use rose because rose keeps grabbing my attention. 
and I'm not really a rose girl, but I guess I am today. Anyways, so we're gonna put this to the side real quick so you guys can have a better view of what I'm about to do. <laughs> so we're gonna start with the first one. Maybe I should have, my organization, okay. So we're gonna start with the first one, which was eucalyptus, peppermint, and lavender. And I will say these scents are very, very strong. Like when I um got them, they I could smell it in the box, but it was a certain smell. I think it was orange that I could smell the most. So I thought that was interesting. Um, so first it comes with a cap so it doesn't spill. So we're just going to take that cap off, put that to the side. And we're going to grab the eyedropper. So um, it said about five for each. That was three, four, five. Okay. And then let me... Yeah, these scents are very strong. These are nice, like good quality <laughs> um, essential oils. So if you want to get you some, I would definitely, like I said, link it below. But besides that, I, I guess a little update. I have been... I thought seasonal depression was just like... I'm like, oh, this is a for real thing. <laughs> like, this is this is no joke, actually. Um, Cause it's like, I find myself, I don't want to say depressed, but it's like, I got so accustomed of being outside 24 seven, like every day, even if it was just go and walk to the park. But like, I got accustomed to making that my safe space where now I'm like, can't really do that, which is like, I can do it, but I can't cause I don't like the code. I'm not the code girl, I'm not, I don't like the code at all. So it's like, I can, but I don't want to. So it's becoming a bit of a struggle. And I know a lot of people can't relate. So if you relate, please comment below, be like, girl, I feel you. Um, cause this really is no joke. <laughs> like, I don't like this feeling, but at the same time, I'm, I'm okay. At the same time, I'm like, perfectly fine I don't know it's a weird time for me oh this smells good okay so I put about 15 drops all together and I think five each one of them I think I put a little more but that's that so we're gonna put the cap on it the little rolling cap and put a top on it and I'm gonna let that sit for a bit. And then once they're all done, then I'll smell each one of them. So the next one we're doing, we're doing, let's see. I don't know how to pronounce this. Jernim? 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 It's a flower, y'all. And then yang, and then rose. So let's do the one I can't pronounce first. <laughs> Um, but yeah, it's just like, and I've also been like trying to look for jobs and nothing really is coming up and it's like a stage in my life that I'm just not used to. Like I'm always in a sense, how can I say this? Like I never had this long of a break of not doing nothing when it comes to like working or going to school. Like when I was in school, I was in school and working full time. So it was like, I was always busy. So now it's like, I've been applying and jobs, honestly, have been acting a bit weird. It's like, they will give you the interview, have you come once or twice. And then it's like, they don't call back. And it's like, well, why did I come in the first place? <laughs> um, so I'm kind of in that part where it's like, I have interviews, but like, ain't nobody want to call back. So it's, it's a weird time for me, honestly, it's very weird. And it's like, it's like also where I'm at in the sense of, I see what's going on. <laughs> like I, I know there is something better obviously waiting if every other door is closing. It's just, I am stubborn. <laughs> I could be very stubborn. 
and I'm working on it, especially towards trusting myself and the universe and like, oh, this is not closing. And just making sure that like, I'm aware that everything really is happening for me and not against me. Okay, y'all, this thing is not closing. Um, that thing, it's like doors are closing on me and I'm not used to that. <laughs> and it's really just me having to trust. And I'm realizing I have trust issues. I will admit it, I have trust issues. And it sucks because it's not like I can just wake up one day and be like, oh my God, I trust everything. Everything's, you know, like I can, but it does take steps. Like it does take time and I'm realizing that more and more, which is also difficult because I'm like, I want everything to happen now, right now. I want things to change right now. I want everything to be everything right now, but that's not the case. So, we love that, don't we? Oh, this one smells good. Mm. <clears throat> this one smells interesting, actually. It smells good and then it doesn't. So we'll see. So we're gonna close that one up and we are on our third one. So we have Jasmine, Sage, and Lemongrass. But, yeah, even when I'm like, even making YouTube videos legit has been the only thing that's keeping me afloat. <laughs> like, I'm actually really grateful. I remember like in high school, I used to always talk about, oh, let's make, let me make a YouTube channel. Let me make a YouTube channel. And honestly, it was just, at that age and that time, I was just scared to like present myself authentically. I didn't want to seem like weird or like outsider energy so I avoided it for a very long time and then like everything else at one point I was like I am tired of hiding <laughs> so I'm very grateful that I did this for myself and of course not just for me but for people out there who are actually in the same predicament or same situation or same mindset like me that now can like have an outsider support or can see themselves in a different perspective or have a support so because girl you're not alone that's for sure we're not alone it's just it can feel very lonely sometimes but yeah youtube legit has been saving me from boredom and going crazy <laughs> So I actually really love that and I'm very grateful for you guys and I'm just grateful for this moment no matter how crazy it may seem or how uncertain things may feel I am actually really grateful <laughs> like I talked about it in my last video where I was like you know expressing that gratitude is not it's not like It's really not how somebody looks or speaks or act like it's really not a personality thing it's really an attitude like just because I might look sad does not mean at all that I'm not grateful so I had to really learn that where I was like just because I might be depressed it doesn't mean I'm not grateful it just means I can't feel my emotions and get through it with grace Ooh. okay these scents are very interesting <laughs> it's like interesting where i wasn't expecting it to smell the way it smells okay we have one more y'all one more okay and the last one is rosemary grapefruit and lemon let me do lemon first but yeah it's a beautiful day though. The sun is out, the moon was gorgeous, and shoot, I'm alive. <laughs> That's the best thing about this is I can I can complain, but like I'm happy to be alive for me to complain realistically. 
Which it sounds cheesy as hell. Even saying that, I'm like cringing. But this is the truth. Like, I'm grateful to be able to complain. I'm grateful that I'm able to be depressed. I'm grateful that I might be going crazy. <laughs> I'm grateful for it. It's an experience that obviously, I guess in the sense my soul needs to experience or that I need to experience in this life path. And it is what it is. And I know that before coming here, I, I signed up for this. Like I, I knew exactly what I was getting myself into. So I can't be acting surprised because <laughs> We all knew this was coming. This one, this is my favorite smell right here, actually. The last one, save the best for last, right? You know, I just realized I didn't label these. <laughs> I didn't label them. I don't even know what's in here no more. And I put the essential oils away. You ever smell something and it, it reminds you of someone? But like, I don't know anyone who smells like this though. But it reminds me of a person. Those stuff, like stuff like that be creeping me out. I'm like, who is this person? Okay, let's do this another one. Ooh, oh, okay. I wish I remember these names. <laughs> This one is really nice. Uh, the second one? What was in there? Oh my god. I'm gonna have to look back at this video and label these. <laughs> and then let's smell this one. Ooh, this smells like cologne. Oh my god, this smells like a cologne. Girl! Let me find out I'm doing something, y'all. <laughs> this is the last one. <laughs> Let me find out. I, ooh, okay. Girl, I, I might have to start selling. Guys, if you want me to start sell <laughs> if you want me to start selling essential oil perfumes, let please. Let me know. <laughs> but anyways, that's really it. This is this video. Not much. Um if you've gotten this far, thank you for watching. And if you enjoyed these type of videos, um, like the video and I will make more of these if this is something you guys want to watch. But other than that, I'm going to go and enjoy the rest of my day, eat some breakfast, chill out for a bit. But again, thank you for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed and see you in my next video. Peace, y'all. Peace and love.